let's see what flight this is going to be if it's going to be a thermal flight a cross-country flight or maybe just i'm going to glide down thanks a lot once again for tuning in enjoy this video and subscribe if you like reaching the cloud base guys okay I see here is a strong one let's see if I can keep it and once I reach the end of it I go cross country let's see how far I can reach Now that's it. <laughs> it's cold, man. Okay, anyway, I am now heading to the same mountain like the flight before. If you didn't see it as yet, check it out. And uh, let's see if I can find the thermos on the other side of the mountain. I am trying to reach again the chapel, uh, get some altitude over it, and fly uh, next to the, the other uh, launch site. I am flying with a uh, northwest wind, which is not uh, so good. I wish I would have had the west more. Let's see what I can find along the way. I am losing a lot of altitude here, which is really not good. 46 kilometers per hour now. I am really curious to see with how much altitude I arrive at uh, the chapel. I left at 1,700 meters. I see this time other people here going cross country. And... Uh, Yes, I'm not the only one this time. I lost already almost 400 meters and I'm halfway through. But I am really, really slow right now. I'm not sure if you can see on the camera. There is one glider, a second one, a third one. And there is another one somewhere here or two of them. I think it's a CC C glider and a C1 and uh, yeah they reach much further than I am it's crazy how much altitude I lost unbelievable wow I am dropping here literally dropping that's so bad whoa okay oh man after reaching the cloud base at 1700 meters, I went on my cross country journey being very positive about it. Two days prior to this one, I left at 1500 meters and reached further than I anticipated. On my way over the valley, I lost significant altitude, no matter if accelerated or not. I was just dropping more than usual. The wind was coming from the northwest, but I kept flying west, so maybe that was decelerating me a bit too. Halfway over the valley, I spotted other pilots with sea wings or better, so I knew trying to keep up with them would be the same as if you tried to catch up with a Mustang in a Prius. I should have maybe left the wind push me southeast to the other ridge. So, here am I now, struggling with a strong wind, trying to center these scattered thermals. What you are about to see was for real a close call. Enjoy! Oh man, the wind is coming from the west and it's pushing me in the forest. Whoa, drop! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh my god, crazy! What the hell? Oh shit! Whoa, I was so close! the forest there crazy I'm not sure if I will be able to make anything here I was in this situation before 
and uh, it's looking pretty bad for me right now but never give up right yeah I think that's it for today it is extremely hard to center I lost a lot of altitude oh my god that was nothing that's it ready to I am ready to land at least now I can show you exactly where I learned paragliding which is right here right here in front of me I learned how to paraglide for the very first time yeah it was like another try for me I gave my best that's how it is sometimes it's working sometimes not uh, yeah there's not much I can do Anyway, that was for today. I just didn't find any more thermals. I lost a lot of altitude between the starting place and the next place where I was supposed to get altitude. I just lost 500 meters almost. And uh, that's it. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed and you're new to my channel, please subscribe, give me a big thumbs up, and see you in the next one.